Peace, love, and light, Cancer. Welcome back to the channel. I see you, Tarot. I'm here to do a reading for you guys and see what you need to know at this time. Let's clear the energy. Okay. Let's see. What is going on for Cancer at this time, Divine? You might be receiving some type of clarity from someone that really wants to be with you at this time. The Ace of Cups. Yeah. I'm getting a feeling of love in the air. There's love in the air. This could be talking about someone that was once childish before. I'm hearing at first I was lost, but now I'm found. <laughs> What's that at the bottom? We got the three of swords. Someone could have been a heartbreaker here. Like at first I was lost, you know, going around breaking people's hearts, but now I'm found because I found you. Oh wow. Just my camera here. My camera keep coming out of focus. All right, this is going to get this message for you, Cancer. What do you want Cancer to know at this time, Divine? Thank you. What do you have for Cancer? Oh, we got the Six of Cups. So this is definitely talking about somebody from your past here. Past situation. With the Ace of Cups at the bottom of the deck with the Six of Pentacles and the Knight of Cups. Yeah, somebody here definitely wants to come close to you. Somebody wants you here. This could be some type of childhood friend or something. Oh, we got the Emperor. Some type of boss. Mmm, okay. I'm here. I'm the biggest boss that you've seen thus far. Ooh, I've seen the Three of Swords again. Look at that Page of Swords. That's why I said that in the beginning, this could, this could have been someone that was very childish because the Page of Swords is at the bottom of the deck. This person was a heartbreaker before. This person used to break hearts, but now I'm hearing that they met their match. Something about meeting their match here. We got Scorpio Energy out here, Aries. Let's get some more for Cancer. We got the two of swords here. Look at the lovers peeking out with the word at the bottom of the deck. This man used to play people and close out cycles. Wow, this is definitely a heartbreaker. This could be someone older and they're, I'm getting early 30s to middle 40s, I'm hearing. This is someone with an old school type of mindset. Oh, wow, we got the Five of Swords. I'm telling you, this person used to portray people in relationships. They really did. They were very violent. I'm not getting a violent as in they used to hit people or anything, but they just used to like, it's like a hit it and quit it type of energy. They used to break hearts. They really did. But now this person, like, well, they want to settle down. They want to get rid of their player ways. And it's because of you. We got Libra energy out here, Aquarius. Let's get some more for Cancer, please. Thank you. We got the nine of pentacles out here. I'm telling you, this man used to leave people out in the cold. I am getting the energy of he was a provider. So he did provide for these women. You know, he gave them money and everything, but it's like he gave them money to take care of them, to play mind games with them. And then he turned around and left them out in the cold. Yeah, a lot of manipulation with this magician. He used to manipulate women a lot, but then he came across the empress. He came across you and you, you did something to him. You change something within this masculine. What's the Six of Cups here? We got the Page of Pentacles. Ooh. I'm getting someone, someone stood in their divinity. Like, you know your worth here. So this, he, this masculine is used to dealing with women that don't really know their worth. I feel like this man is really desiring you. They're desiring you. We got two pages out here. So definitely picking up on some childish energy. What's this Six of Cups here with the Page of Pentacles? Three cards came out. Okay. Look at that. The Six of Pentacles, the Six of Wands, and the Two of Cups. I just showed y'all the Six of Pentacles. This man feels like, mmm, they feel a lot of happiness with you. This person feel like, he, they feel like this person could have possibly been used by a lot of feminists. They can look very good here. And a lot of feminists that came into their life, like, I'm not just going to put it off on this masculine because, you know, sometimes when men look good, you do have women that come in and they come towards this type of man just to use them for their finances. So I'm getting that on both ends here. He could have used some type of some women and some women could have used him. Hmm. What is this two of cups here specifically? 
Because this man is a boss. He's ready to take care of somebody full time here. We've got the four of pentacles and judgment. Yeah. He could have definitely held back from some type of past relationship, or you could have you could have held back from him somehow. We got Capricorn energy out here. We do got Cancer energy out here, Leo, Taurus. You could have called judgment on this person. Never you find that wasn't really fair in the situation. What's the Emperor here? You got the three of swords. I'm telling you, this Emperor used to break hearts. They broke hearts. This person was under judgment, though. I feel like they, you were their judgment because of the past situations that they, they was in, breaking people's hearts here. They broke hearts. What's this page of swords? And they possibly tried to break your heart, too, but you wasn't going for it. I feel like you got the fuck out of Dodge. You got the moon here. Hmm. This person is curious about you. They dream about you. What's the moon here with the page of swords? You got the seven of pentacles. I'm telling you, something about you is very, very different. And they're trying to figure out what that is. This person has dreams about you. They're always thinking about you. Trying to figure out. This person's trying to figure out some type of information on you. You could possibly have this person block here. This is definitely somebody in your past. What's this two of swords? We got the queen of cups. You, you the queen of cups. You come out here as the queen of cups. And that's cancer energy. Yes, you're very caring, very loving. And you're very intuitive too, so you're not stupid. This person can easily play you because you're not stupid. And when I feel like when they try to, you deaded that shit. And we got Aries energy here with Scorpio energy. This person could be a Scorpio or an Aries. This person is looking for you. They're looking for you. What's this Queen of Cups with the Two of Swords? They're looking for you, sweetie. Ooh, we got the sun. Yeah, something about this person was exposed to you with your intuition. You received some type of clarity about this individual. I, would, I believe it was to get the fuck on because this person was low-key trying to play you. Like, you moving away from them was their karma. What's this Five of Swords? Yep. The five of Cups at the bottom of the deck. Five Five could be significant. Yep, the Nine of Swords with the Five of Cups at the bottom of You was this person's karma. You was the last person this individual was going to be able to, to try to play or break heart. Look, you was, you was guided away from this individual. And they know you were guided away from them. I thought this person know that you're very intuitive here. What's the Five of Swords here with the Nine of, with the, uh, nine of Swords? You definitely got this person all in their head, yo. We got the page of cups out here. We got three pages out here. This person is very childish in the way that they think. They definitely got some type of healing to do if this situation is meant to be. What's this nine of pentacles? Well, we got strength. You was not backing down. You are not backing down. You know your worth. All them other women, they probably didn't know their worth, but counsel, you knew yours. It was like, uh-uh, baby, I don't think so. <laughs> you was fired up in this situation. You can have Leo having your chart. You can have a Leo moon. Or Leo rising. What's the strength here with the nine of pentacles? You was not playing. Oh, we got the ace of pentacles. You're like, I got my own money here. Like, I'm telling you, this masculine, he takes care of women. And then he turn around and, and you know, he he discards them. But because you got your own, you, you didn't need any of that. You wasn't putting up with it. Let's get an oracle here. Let's get an oracle here for counsel, please. Wait, that flipped over too fast. Let's get an oracle. This man feels lonely without you. All he got to says here, I know that there is no greater goal than to love. You making this mess and fall in love with you. Clarify success. They're falling in love with you, Cancer. Because you stood your ground. You, you, stood, you stood up to this person. You was not going to devalue yourself here. You and this person is possibly meant to be. Look at that nine of cups. I'm telling you, you stood up to this person. You know your value. You can be happy alone. This definitely given. I can, I can do it on my own. I can do it by myself. Let's get a, a relationship message. I just want to get one from here. Hidden truth. Ooh, I remember every detail of that day with I want you at the bottom of this man wants you because you did not put up with his shit. Clarify, I remember every detail of that day. The day that you left him, he remember every detail of, look at that, four cups. I just told y'all earlier that the lovers were speaking out. This man is reminiscing. He wants you. He want, this could be a twin flame or a soulmate connection here, Cancer. I'm telling you. You guys could possibly, like, meet up again one day. I don't know here, but this y'all, Mrs. Cancer. Mwah. See y'all in the next video. Thank you.